Welcome to Yoga Darshan. Join us on a musical presentation exploring the sights, sounds, texts and traditions from all over India in classical Tamil and Sanskrit that illustrate that the yoga we practice today has been an integral and sustained part of the cultural and religious traditions of India for millennia. Mano Navadwara Nishit Vritti Hare Divya Vasthapya Samadhi Vasham Yamaksharam Shetra Vedo Atmanam Atmanya Balo Kayantam Atmanam Atmanya Balo Kayantam Atmanam Atmanya Balo Kayantam Thank you. 
Ashtanga Yoga is a well-known one. Many would also be aware of the Yoga Sutras of the great sage Patanjali and with verses in the ancient Upanishads and the Gita that deal with yoga. The classical Tamar language is rich in yoga-related writings in the first millennium. The Tirumandiram presents Ashtanga Yoga in a framework of Shiva Bhakti. Tantric traditions across a wide and diverse sweep of land from Assam to the Deep South emphasize yoga, as do the works of Adi Shankara of Kerala, who traveled the length and breadth of India. ஆமை போல் ஐந்தடக்கலாற்றின் எழுமையும் ஏமா புடைத்து ஒருமையுள் ஆமை போல் ஐந்தடக்கலாற்றின் எழுமையும் ஏமா புடைத்து ராஜயோக சம்யுதோ பவே ஹட யோக 
ಯೋಗೇನ ರಾಜಯೋಗ ಸಂಯುತೋ ಭವೇ state of Kashmir is the birthplace of various works such as the Shiva Sutras and the Vijnana Bhairava Tantra. It is also the place of origin of Sarangadev, whose musical treatise Sangeeta Ratnakara stresses Kundalini Yoga. It is clear from Tamar literature that these terms were casually used in the vernacular and that these ideas were present and alive in various parts of India a thousand years ago. Yes. 
the Nath tradition of the early medieval period produced works on Hatha Yoga that elaborated upon the physical poses. From Gorakhpur in northern India to Gujarat in western India, depiction of yoga poses in Vijayanagar, asanas were firmly etched in word, song, stone and metal. The Tamar Shaiva Siddhanta stresses Ashtanga Yoga, the Hamsa Ajapa meditation and the Ajapa dance, which continue to appear in verses and in art music across India and have been an integral part of temple traditions in the deep south for centuries. Hatasya Prathamangatvad Asanam Purva Muchyate Kulyatadasanam Stairyam Arokyam Changalagavam Chaturashityasanani Shivena Kathitani Cha Siddham Padmam Tathasimham Bhadram Veti Chatushtayam
century witnessed an awakening ushered in by the great spiritual leader Swami Vivekananda. Globalization led to the spread of ideas and the practice of Hatha Yoga and its associated health benefits worldwide. The Indic word yoga is now a part of a global vocabulary. Let us acknowledge and celebrate the dharmic spiritual ecosystem behind the word yoga. A system which on one front stresses Patanjali's goal of discovering the true nature of oneself, the Yoga Yagnya Valkya's goal of finding union with the oneness of existence, and Yoga Marga of the Shiva Bhakti tradition. We offer our gratitude to the rishis, yogis, authors, and innumerable nameless gurus and acharyas of India who over the past three millennia have been silent contributors to the well-being of humanity. As yoga, which is ingrained in a multitude of religious traditions all over India, continues to be embraced around the world. that yoga is for all of humanity, especially during these trying times when we as a community need to come together to defeat our common enemies such as the pandemic of today and endemic problems of the globe such as poverty and mistrust. The physical and spiritual well-being of the world is our ultimate common goal. Join us in wishing the best for one and all 
in the true spirit of an ancient Hindu blessing. May all be blessed with boundless joy. May all be free from needless fear. In this world of harmony, may peace and joy prevail.